What's up, everybody? Unfortunately, Reacher Season 2 has come to an end, and man, I love this show. There will, of course, be spoilers in this review, so make sure you finish the season before watching this video. Now, let's get into it. Much like the show, I loved this finale. At first, I did think maybe it was going to repeat Season 1's a little too much, but then it does gain its own personality pretty quick. The, the uh, episode opens as we continue Reacher and Langston's first meeting from last week, and Reacher being Reacher beats the shit out of the goons, but the catch, his hands are cuffed behind his back. I made sure to look up uh, their, her name this week, or today I guess, and any action movie or show should be looking to Jennifer Nichols, who did wonderful work as a choreographer this season. Anyway, with that acknowledged, Neely is out dealing with the goons, sniping them like a badass, and Langston gives O'Donnell a pretty bullet wound on his leg thanks to Reacher's shenanigans. It's also revealed here that Swan is dead, Reacher was right about him, and Langston has one of his eyes and one of his thumbs to put the blame on him. I love this twist because I did originally believe Swan was in on it, then I started looking forward to the reunion, and then, well... <laughs> We landed here. I just love how they light all of it out, really. Then, Senator Lavoie's help arrives, his three personal security guards, and seemingly they're just in time as Dixon and O'Donnell are being loaded onto the helicopter to meet their demise. That chopper does get to take off before they can stop them as Langston escapes during the shootout in the warehouse. This is what I was talking about earlier with the repetitiveness, but the episode does take its own identity after this, so it turned out okay. But he shouldn't have been making all those gorilla jokes about Reacher because he jumps right on that wheel and climbs into the helicopter when the back doors open and he goes to town. That is, until Dixon starts to fall out because Langston took the safeties, or whatever the hell you call them, the things to keep the stretchers in place, he took those off. So, Reacher has to save her multiple times while dealing with Langston and one of his goons and somehow, some way, this man keeps her up long enough for her to then get free while she's dangling in the air, and climb up the stretcher, and I think she climbed up Reacher's arm maybe too, or else he helped her up, and stabbed the goon. I mean, this sequence was so contained being in the helicopter, but it still managed to be so goddamn cool, just like every other fight in this show. I love them all. Once they take care of Langston, though, they had to meet AM and give him a taste of his own medicine, as he's on the receiving end of some badassery this episode, instead of dishing it out. Then, as if they hadn't had a day already, Lavoie's three guards uh, betray them, but Reacher's too good for that, as he also called Homeland when he called them in, and they're helping take this whole thing down. This was actually a damn good twist towards the end here, and you know, I probably should have seen it coming, but what can I say? I was just engulfed in the action and missed it, I guess. The season closes as Reacher uses the money to help out the families of his fallen brothers and the remaining special investigators go their separate ways and Dixon and Reacher aren't going to last. And you know, whew, I might not watch season three because of this. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'd never stop watching this show, but I was very upset that they're not going to be together anymore because they were the dictionary definition of a power couple. And so that'll do it for my final review of Reacher season two. This season somehow flew past the first in terms of quality and my personal enjoyment hitting on the action, the emotion, the music, I mean just everything. I love this show so much and I need season 3 as soon as possible. But let me know what you thought of this season and the finale down in the comments below and make sure you have a great day.